President Muhammad Buhari, who was represented by the Minister of Health, Dr. Osage Haniri, described University of Benin Teaching Hospital as the best asset in South-South Zone of the country. He said the hospital has done marvelously well and assured the management of the federal government support. The strategic location of UBTH in Benin City as the gateway to the Niger Delta region keeps this hospital the central role in the national strategy to build a resilient health system. The governor of Edo State, Mr. Godwin Obaseki, said UBTH expansion has been rapid and that the hospital has continued to make tremendous contributions to the healthcare delivery and commended UBTH management for exceptional performance during the COVID-19 pandemic. This institution has provided high quality healthcare and teaching to medical students and has trained some of the best doctors. The CMD UBTH, Professor Darlington Obaseki, said the hospital has achieved so much in the last 50 years and expressed gratitude to all who have in one way or another contributed to the success story. We are taking on more than 58 emergencies every day. We admit more than 80 patients every month. More than 80 something hospitals, other hospitals with five patients here. It's a very busy hospital. While former head of state General Jakubu Gowan went down memory lane to recall the days of the beginning of the hospital, some participants, who include the president of the World Medical Association, described the event as epoch making. UBTH has been a cornerstone of healthcare delivery in Nigeria since its inception. That my father's name is UBTH. His life, his time. When he was alive, it was a glorious one. And I want to say that this has been a very magnificent occasion uh, where we have to reflect on where we are coming from and hopefully use the opportunity to also prepare for the tax ahead. A guest speaker and chairman of Sterling Bank, Barrister Aswen Igodalo, in a lecture titled Advancing the Legacy of Quality Health Care, said it is only a healthier population that can think more creatively to build a great nation and added that a weak health care system cannot guarantee such. High point of the ceremony was the unveiling of the statue of the then military governor of Midwest State whose administration bettered the hospital. Some posthumously, Pius Nsogo, ITV News.